I'm Chris Brogan. So I was just talking with Rob Hatch here about the fact that uh, there's an interesting revelation we had about video and quality of video. And what's kind of funny is I swear this isn't an ad. I swear this isn't like, gee whiz, you need to buy Go to Meeting. Uh, it's just something we we realized or Rob realized and I thought was quite interesting. So Rob is Chief Operating Officer at Human Business Works. We work together, but we work virtually. Rob's in Maine and I'm in Massachusetts. Rob, what was your little note of thing you noticed? Well, if we were talking uh, about working virtually and about um, being in uh, either conference rooms with people or meetings with people and being able to be attentive to what they're saying. And I think that in virtual work, when we have online meetings, we are often not as attentive to the people that are participating. Um, maybe we'll you know turn the video off or or just and just listen to the audio. But I think the quality of the video uh, has something to do with our ability to attend. And if if it's really fuzzy and and it isn't of great quality, then we're more more likely to dismiss it. Whereas something that's more high quality, a high depth video, then I can I see you and I see your expressions better, and I feel like I can attend to you and 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 kind of read your cues a little better. I find that interesting, and I agree. I, I think that sometimes using different video services, uh, we get a different quality. And if it's really shutter, you know, juddery and, and staticky, or if lighting is just off by a bit or something, you know, it changes things. But I think with this shiny, clear go go, you know, go to meeting high def stuff that we're using right now, it, it's it's just a nicer quality. Um, I was laughing because also our lighting is so crazy. Mine is because the sun is here, and I've got a curtain up, and it's just blaring through. So I look like this yellowy white ghost. And you. Uh, your lighting is kind of behind you. So, you know, I've, I've given you permission to uh, rethink getting like LED lights or something and putting them down on you, which is what I did. I mean, my setup now is I've got a bunch of LED lamps that I use for lighting me. Um, I oh, bought, really? Yeah, I bought them on Amazon because I just didn't have a chance to go down to Ikea. But the idea was for things like video because I yeah. can't, the sun is too bright, but you need this now. You have to think about lighting and video. Isn't that weird? It is a little weird. Uh, it's not something that I'm obviously paying much attention to right now. So, so the whole backlit. Um, but you know, and also, I, you know, I think if uh, depending on the meeting, just all, uh, what you're really talking about is your presentation as well and how you're appearing on video, not just lighting. But it, it's important because you, and, and I think that increases the um, perhaps maybe it increases the accountability to the people that you're with. You realize that you want to be. Um, present with them as well and you want them to see you and be present and hear what you have to say. I think it's totally true. Rob Hatch, Chief Operating Officer of Human Business Works, thanks for a few minutes out of your busy day. Hey man, take care. It's good seeing you.